prominent Nigerians from all walks of life on Tuesday gathered in Portaget to celebrate the 70th birthday of former River State Governor Dr. Peter Odili for being a defender of sustained development of Nigeria. Former Kano State Governor Senator Riabi Musa Konkoso, former Edo State Governor Loki Benedion, former Kogi State Governor Idris Wada, former River State Governor Sarcelest Nomeha, former President Court of Appeal Justice Umaru retired, and former Kwaibom Military Governor Colonel Bako retired, were joined by former ministers, serving senators, National Assembly, traditional rulers, professionals, and renowned jurists turned up to pay glowing tribute to an outstanding political leader. River State Governor Yeso Mezanwike, his wife, Justice Eberichi Suzet Yeso Wike, River State Executive Council, State Judiciary and Legislature were among dignitaries who celebrated Odili in a public lecture organized in honor of the former River State Governor by the River State Government under the leadership of Governor Wike. Nigerian leaders hailed Dr. Odili for investing his intellect and resources in building the country. In a lecture titled Sir Dr. Peter Odili, Defender of the Faith, Defender of the Fatherland, former Attorney General of the Federation Chief Kanu Agavi San said the former River State Governor is an ornament of River State. Formerly, he belonged to River State. He has long since been, ceased to be the property of this state. He is now the property of the nation and indeed of the world. Agavi said that Odili is an outstanding humanist who is courageous and committed to the growth of the country. Whatever he has done, he has done for the benefit of mankind. Whatever he has refrained from doing, he refrained in the interest of society. The former Attorney General of the Federation added that the former River State Governor used power to advance public good, noting that he never deserted his friends whilst in office. He noted that the array of guests celebrating him is a proof of his loyalty to them. Dr. Peter Odili, he has been acclaimed not only by family, by friends, and kinsmen, but also by an entire nation. He called for the unity of the country where all Nigerians can walk anywhere, respective of their state of origin. Agave called for the setting up of a national integration center to build a united country. I have always said, and I will go and say, we have a good nation. Nigeria is not Sodom. Nigeria is not Gomorrah. It's a good nation. It is not that nation out of which the Lord could not find ten good people. It's a nation of millions and millions and millions of good men and women. Give Nigeria a hand. People should come from everywhere, united to honor our brothers and sisters as one people. Agabi praised Justice Mary Odili for providing the right support for the former River State Governor to exploit and be a blessing to all generations. A tribute to Dr. Odili is a tribute to his wife, the Honorable Justice Mary Ukego Peter Odili, CFR. The presence in any home of such a woman is truly the mark of God's faith. All of the man's blessings are in the hands of his wife. You can see then who it is that is the custodian of Dr. Odili's blessing. She has been faithful to that committee. In an epilogue, Publicity Secretary of Afine Ferry, Dr. Yinka Odumakin, said that at 70, Dr. Odili and other men of goodwill should stand and work for revival of the country. That a set of men of goodwill stand up to be counted 
we may witness a major cataclysm in this country. Odu Makin said that the country has lost track and will descend into full-blown dictatorship and anarchy unless Nigerians check the slide. It is clear that there is a gradual descent into full-blown dictatorship and anarchy in our land. And we have put you so much in this country that we should not just allow our countries to go down the drain. Celebrant and former River State Governor Dr. Peter Odili thanked God for his mercies and enabling him with the capacity to transform the society. What can I say unto the Lord? All I have to say is thank you, Lord. Commended Governor Wike for organizing the program to celebrate his 70th birthday. He pledged to continue working for the advancement of humanity. Words cannot describe the man God has given us as the governor of our state. So I just want to use this opportunity that wasn't programmed to say, May God bless you and your dear wife. Let me confess to our royal fathers that my wife and I did not program for an elaborate celebration of my birthday. We wanted something quiet, private. that the father of the state overruled. And as humble children of the state, we could not refuse the directive of our father. and see what he has laid out. I feel terribly humbled. Your Excellency, may God bless you. Audily stated that the River State Governor is committed nationalist whose message is critical to the development of the nation. Keep doing what you are doing. God who watches all of us knows your heart. So people may not like your voice. We will ask them to listen to what you are saying, not the sound of your voice. <laughs> may God bless you all. Secretary to the River State Government, Sir Kenneth Kobani, said that Odile is an indisputable political leader of River State. To acknowledge that the Sullivan is an integral part of our lives, First, as our undisputed political leader and mentor, counselor, role model, and father to all of us here. Chairman of the occasion, former President Court of Appeal, Justice Umaru Abdullah, he said Odili has created a place for himself in the history of Nigeria. To be certain days, a special grace from the Almighty God. And I think we can see that God himself has made a place for the future of me to be 70.